Welcome back everyone. You may be trying to figure out how you can go ahead and change up your settings on your AirPods. That's a very easy process, doesn't take too much time. You can also do this on Android phones too, but I would probably recommend doing it on iPhones a little bit easier and there's a lot more settings you can tinker around with. So first of all, you want to make sure your AirPods are connected. As long as you can see your battery and everything on your AirPods or if you put them close, they come up like this, then you should be good to go. So what you want to do is you want to make your way over to your settings application like this. Then you want to scroll down until you see Bluetooth, which is right here. So you want to go and click on Bluetooth, and then you'll start to see all your, you know, actual Bluetooth devices come up. So what you want to do is you want to go and click on the I that's next to the Bluetooth option, and you'll come into this page. Now when you do that, you will see all these other options and things that you can go ahead and tinker around with. So up top, you can change the name of your AirPods to whatever you want them to be. You can turn on automatic ear detection, and you can, you know, set it up if you want to connect to this iPhone automatically, or if you want to, like, you know, have it so you have to manually connect to it. I'd probably recommend keeping this on. You can actually utilize, you know, spatial audio if you want to see what it sounds like. It's really cool if your AirPod supports it. You can choose which microphone you want to choose from. So if it's automatic, or if it's always left or right EarPod, you can go and choose it from here. You can also turn on optimized battery charging, which is something I would highly recommend you to turn on. It you know saves your battery health on your you know AirPods you know essentially. You can connect it to the Find My network, which is really awesome, and it'll show your AirPods if you ever leave them around or something. You can pretty much pick them up from there. Now this is also very important. A lot of people skip over this, but knowing the model number and your serial number of your AirPods is good in case you ever forget what type of AirPods you have. It's always good to just kind of keep these in mind. But if you know if you know your tech, then you're pretty much good to go. And uh, you can also disconnect and forget this device as well. So if you want to disconnect your AirPods from your device, that's pretty much how you do it too. So that is pretty much the process. It's very, very easy. It doesn't take too much time. That's pretty much to do it. If you guys have any other questions or anything, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that means so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly, that everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.